Check it out guys, today we're doing a video on how to reseal your EPDM roof on your RV or trailer. So first we're gonna uh, start with some pressure washing. Here right, we go. So check it out, you can already see I've done a lot. I started on it so you guys could see the difference. Here's the old roof. You can see clearly right here there's a giant line. So, um, I did the skylight recently, let that dry overnight. Things pretty solid, nothing's leaking, and I'm just pressure washing it first, and then we're gonna use the cleaner and activator on top. I'll show you what that stuff is. And then we're going to um, let it dry completely after we rinse it off. And then you go ahead and paint on your layer of EPDM that goes on top of this, is, which is like putting a fresh layer of rubber on top. Um, we're going to do that and we're going to do the pop out as well. So let's get to it. Alright guys, so now that uh, that's all done, I'm going to use this Dicor product um, cleaner activator. So you basically just put it on, scrub it, let it sit for 15 minutes, and then you rinse it all off. They say don't get it on anything else other than the roof. That's really hard to do and lots of prep work, so I'm just going to make sure I rinse everything down really well afterwards. So uh, let's do it. All right guys, so now that this has been sitting for 15 minutes, I'm gonna go ahead and wash it off. All right guys, so here is everything needed for the second part of this after you pressure wash and everything's dry. Um, you're gonna need a paintbrush, opener, your Dicor um, EPDM roof, a roller, medium roller, and a new thing to put your paint in. So here we go. So check out the difference already. I got to do this quick because it dries pretty fast, but before, after. All right guys, so check it out. First coat's done. It's dry to touch. And then uh, I'm going to go ahead and do my second coat. I'm going to do this one as thick as I can because it's the last coat and uh, then the roof will be completely sealed. You just really wanna make sure you get the cracks, anything that looks like it has a little bit of a crack, but basically we're just building up another layer of um, the rubber on top of this. It's kind of a temporary fix without you wanting to redo your entire roof and pulling all the EPDM material up, which is a lot of work. Um, this trailer's old. I feel like if I just keep doing these, we'll be solid. Uh, the main leaks were the skylights, so those are fixed. You guys could check out the link above and um, see the skylight change out video, um, how to do that. So uh, that's another thing that you would do before this process. Alright guys, second coat is on, walking up the ladder.
So now that this is done, it just needs to dry and you got a brand new roof. Put on all your uh, hatches and everything back on and that's it. Pretty solid, pretty simple. Um, so anyways, thanks for watching the video guys. Any questions, comments, suggestions, put them below. Subscribe on the left hand side. Hope you enjoyed the video. Again, if you want to watch um, how to change out a skylight, I got a video on that. I'll put the link up above. And then um, I'm going to be coming out with some more videos too. we got to remodel the inside. And we're going to be doing uh, that wall. i got to fix that wall inside still. But uh, slowly doing projects here on the homestead. Cheers. Dang.